doing some retail arbitrage and I wanted to talk about my number two favorite app that I use um, while I'm outsourcing. My number two favorite app is called Shopkick. I love Shopkick. If you don't know about Shopkick, it's an app that you can download for your Apple, I believe also your Android phone. And what you do is when you, you turn on the app right before you walk into a store, and if that store is on the Shopkick network, you get kicks. And you'll get 30 kicks for some stores, 100 kicks for other stores. There's sometimes days where there's double the kicks. There's, you know, there's a thing that they have every once in a while on Friday. It's called Blue Friday that, that they offer a ton of kicks. And basically, if you're already going to be walking into a store, just use the app, open it up when you walk in. It uses the GPS on your phone and it knows that you're actually walking into the store. Um, every once in a while, you can even sometimes get kicks just by driving by a store. But you get these kicks and they add up over time. And you're able to use those kicks to get gift cards for stores that you source at, stores that you shop for your family app, uh, that, that you shop for your family. Um, and so I, I love it. There's, there's two ways to get kicks on Shopkick. Um, there's actually three. Uh, the, the number one way, which I use all the time, is the walk-in kicks. Like I said a minute ago, you walk in, you get the kicks, it's added to your account, and it accumulates over time. A second way to do it is in the app, it will tell you specific items to go find in the store and scan those items. Now, um, I usually don't do that just because, um, for me, easy is where I want it to be. Just walking into the store, that's easy. You can get 30 kicks, sometimes 50 kicks, just for walking in a store. But if you find a particular item, um, or if you have the time to walk around the store and find the different items, scan the barcodes of the items, you'll get even more kicks. So if you've got the time to invest in it, I would suggest go for it. Enjoy getting more kicks. And the third way to do it is to you know tell friends about it. And so that's what I want to do right now. There, you know, I'll be able to get some kicks. You can get 50 free kicks if you go to fulltimefba.com forward slash shopkick dash app. And you click on the button in that, that uh, blog post. You can get 50 free kicks just for signing up for Shopkick. So check that out. My wife and I love Shopkick. We both use it. Um, we're, we do it when we're outsourcing. Stores like Walmart. Target, JCPenney, um, I've used it at um, Albertsons a grocery store, uh, I've used it at uh, all sorts of places, um, and when you can have, when you finally get enough kicks, yeah, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Home Goods. in fact there's some times where there's a TJ Maxx and a Home Goods right next door to each other, you can get, you know, walk-in kicks for both of those, absolutely love Shopkick and being able to just rack up these points. And the cool thing about the app is that when it's you, when you have enough kicks and you want to redeem it for a gift card, you don't have to like wait for them to mail it to you, mail you the gift card. You don't have to wait a long time. You don't even have to wait like 24 hours for them to process. You immediately get the gift card inside the app. And so you you know, once you get enough kicks, you can be like, "Hey, I'm in TJ Maxx right now." You know, I want to redeem these shop kicks for a ten dollar gift card. You spend like you know one minute deciding what you want, just and and the amount that you want, how many kicks you want to spend for your gift card, and it is immediately available to you to use while you are there in the store. So I, I love it. My wife loves it. We're we're already out there doing the sourcing. We're already out there doing shopping for like you know, like sometimes we'll go to Target to source. Sometimes we'll go to Target just to look for things for our family, for our grocery trips, or things like that. And so while we're already there, we'll do. If we go together, we'll both get out our apps and we'll both get points. We have different accounts. We we rack up the points, and it's it's really good. Um, so again, there's ways to get points by just walking into the store, and then walking around the store and finding specific items. And if you're new to sourcing, sometimes walking around the store and scanning different items to get shop kicks will help you get your get, 
will help get you out of your comfort zone. Maybe you only go to toys, but this time Shopkick says, hey, go look at this health and beauty item, scan it, and you get some points and then realize, hey, maybe there's some other items I can scan with my Profit Bandit, uh, Scoutify, Scan Power, whichever app, Amazon app that you have uh, to see, get you out of your comfort zone, find some new inventory items. So I love Shopkick. You can find it fulltimefba.com forward slash shopkick dash app. And you can get 50 free kicks just for signing up right there. Um, we absolutely love it. Yes, yeah, scan more items. It helps you get out of your comfort zone, find more inventory, and build up your business. I mean, if you're already walking into a store anyway, you might as well get this. It's basically free money. You just open up your app, get the kicks. When it's time, redeem them for gift cards. We love it. I know you're going to love it too. So I guess That's all the time we have for today. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you like this video, it'd be awesome if you gave me a little thumbs up below. And if you have a comment or a question, you can leave that below too. I'd like to keep the discussion going in the comments about that. If you have anything you want to add, anything you want to ask, you can do that in the comments below. Also below in the description, there you will find links that I talked about during this video. And you can check that out in the description below and it will take you right where you want to go. And you know what? If you'd like to make sure you don't miss out on any future videos, be sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel so you get all of the free Amazon FBA video training that I will be uploading often. And if you want to learn more about how to make a full-time income only spending part-time hours with Amazon FBA, come on over to the website, fulltimefba.com. Subscribe, you'll get some free PDF downloads that will help your Amazon FBA business become a little easier. I want to help. I want to help you make a full-time income with only part-time hours on Amazon FBA, and I will see you soon. Bye.